It's a watermark stainless steel solenoid valves. They go from quarter inch to two inch, normally closed and normally open. This is a normally closed unit, a WS35 series. They come with a connector plug, which is a LED plug, uh, which you can connect on there, and also you can mount that in three different other directions, each at 90 degrees by rotating it around with through the plug itself. How to connect the plug up is shown on our website. The valve is a differential valve, 16 bar maximum pressure rating, 0.3 or 0.7 depending on the size, 0.3 up to 1 inch, 0.7 to 2 inch, minimum differential. These valves also have a low differential tolerance so they're very good for anti-water hammer um, and where small flows are required through a large valve they want to pulse. Take the valve apart. The flow for this valve is as per the arrow on the side here. Inlet, outlet requires pump pressure, so it's a differential valve, mains water pressure. Take this section off here. This is the pilot assembly. Armature assembly inside here. Armature has a little spring in it and that's operated by the coil when the coil is energized. Armature goes up operating the valve and it's de-energized the armature comes back out again. Valve lid. I've loosened off these previously. Lid has a a jet machined in the, in the top of it there which the seat comes down on. The watermark valves have EPDM diaphragm assemblies. The diaphragm with a return spring to keep the valve diaphragm closed even at very very low pressures the valve won't leak. There's a little jet here which equalizes the pressures and that's the valve diaphragm itself with the seat. For assembling the valve, that unit goes back in here. There is a little indicator on here which goes into this hole. And just in the reverse of what we've seen, the spring goes on top of there. This unit goes on here. Bodies 304 stainless and the diaphragm materials EPDM. Spring assembly goes in like that. Coil on here and nut. Coil can be changed while the valve is working in line anytime. And that's the valve completed.